and those, all the proceeds go to the Safford Lions Foundation. Uh, my husband and I, we live in Tucson currently. Um, we came out to visit his parents and ended up here because we didn't even realize it was this weekend. I was like, yay, salsa! <laughs> I grew up in Tucson. I've always been from su in southern Arizona. I love spicy food. I love salsa. Um, as long as it's spicy with good flavor, I'm a happy girl. <laughs> I'm David Beckel from Mesa, Arizona. And uh, last year, my wife and I come up here uh, just because we've seen the festivities happening. And uh, we've seen the contest and we participated in the taste test. But uh, I got a buddy of mine that I went to high school with, so me and him came up to enter the contest today. So, fun! <laughs> uh, about 10 years ago, the Safford Lions Club uh, decided to start this salsa fest. There were several people in the community that felt it would be a good idea. And as always, as hard as we work, suddenly we were in charge of the event. I love salsa and I love taste tests, so this is the perfect combination for me. I like all the different flavors and seeing what other people do with their salsa. My name's Ronnie Aguilar and I got involved with Lions Club in this about five years ago. And the first year I made, actually made it for the challenge. And I got like second place. So then after that I thought, okay, I did my time, now I'm just going to do the they asked me to do the, the challenge for the eating contest and every year I try to get a little bit hotter and hotter and last year we had two girls that just drank it. So I figured well I'm going to try to make it hotter this year so they asked me to make it a little bit hotter and I think I got it this time. I used uh, jalapenos, fresh jalapenos and this year I put some habaneros in it. It's a little bit hotter than it was last year. Uh, we got a pretty good club here but I've got volunteers that aren't have no association with lions here. So I think that's the beauty of it. It brings everybody together and says, okay, this is a good event for the good of the community. This is our second year. Last year we got third for People's Choice for being our first year, so that was pretty good. We're hoping for better this year. <laughs> we were approached by the Salsa Fest committee. Uh, when they first put it together, it was kind of a tourist thing for the Safford area, and they figured tomato, salsa, I mean, it goes hand in hand. So they approached us, and we're like, oh yeah, let's let's get in on this and be part of it. And of course, it's a great event for this community and the whole salsa trail. And um, and so as of right now, we pr we actually donate all the tomatoes that are used for the competition. Their first time here, they moved from Tucson here, and. Uh, we always heard about the Tosso Fest and we decided to come on out and uh, take a gander at it and uh, it's Ooh, hot. Can you tell they're sweaty? <laughs> yeah, no water. We haven't had water yet, so we wanted to get the full effect. So all of them, all of them were excellent. Very good. My name is Joy Martin and we're in Safford, Arizona at the Salsa Fest. And this is Paige and this is Darcy. And we look forward to coming every year. We love it. Um, our favorite part is the chips and the salsa. For five bucks, we like to go and just sample all the salsa and see what all the different restaurants and everyone has to offer, and we just love it. And what else do we love? We love the bouncy houses and all the activities that the kids have, and the music and everything. It's just a really lot of a lot of fun to get together as a community.